Putnam County Fair would have been this week, and just like many summer favorites, it was canceled because of the pandemic. But as 13 News reporter Lily Bradley found out, one of the more popular events lives on, thanks to some creative thinking and some pretty hardworking kids. The coronavirus has forced many businesses and organizations to get creative. So from the fields of green to your computer screen, a part of the Putnam County Fair is going virtual this year. An annual summertime favorite in Putnam County. 4-H'ers like Ariel Thomas look forward to the Putnam County Fair each year. I've raised goats for six years for the Putnam County Fair. It is a part of the summer that I definitely look forward to, to have fun with friends and meet new people. Raising goats takes a lot of patience and work. It's a lot of hard work. You have to be very willing to put hard work into it. And time. So when the fair was canceled, Ariel says she was worried that her hard work would be for nothing. All of these kids had raised these animals and started their projects long before COVID ever became a thing. And so we wanted to come up with a way for them to be able to go ahead and sell their animal, recoup some of the expenses that they've had and still have somewhat of the experience that they would have had at the fair. So the livestock portion of the event is being hosted virtually this year and it's proven to be a success. It's done very well. We had a, a good time at the weigh in and um, so we're moving forward the best we can. The online auction continues through Wednesday with bidding ending at 5 p.m. We've got a link to that online auction on our website. Just go to WOWKTV.com. Reporting in Putnam County, I'm Lily Bradley, 13 News, working for you. And with hiccups in the supply chain, the pandemic has made a lot of people seek out locally sourced food. Parsons said they already have agreements with meat processing plans, so actually there won't be a wait for those who purchase animals.